the bundles. Bundles exist. If you make your whole fan base buy, it's not about music anymore. If you make your whole fan base buy merch, it buys the number one. You can buy a number one. I didn't prove it to you yet. You can buy streams. You can buy bundles. You can buy. You can buy a number one. I didn't tell you that. I didn't tell you that. What does it take you to <laughs> fucking believe you can buy a number one? That is bad. I didn't tell you that. <laughs> take it from a person who's successful. You can buy a number one. Okay. All right. So stop. What does that mean? So now they know. All right. All right. So now they know it's rigged. But but they got three hundred followers. They got hot songs. How do they make it into an industry that's rigged? You can buy number ones. You everything is essentially programmed that you have to follow if you just want to be easily successful. What should they do if they have two hundred followers? Yo yo, this is by the way, by the way, by the way. Before you even answer. I'm going to tell you why, and a lot of people, like, you're tuning into my live, and I know you don't have to like 6 9 You don't have to like 6 9 Let me tell you how I came up. Just, just 20 seconds. I came up, I'm, I'm not a traditional media outlet. I came up from doing YouTube. I came up from creating something that didn't exist. A lot of people don't like me. Y'all can see last week, they tried to cancel me. They can't when, cancel you. When 6 9 is talking, and even me allowing this platform here, it's because... I'm trying to let y'all know what I've seen over the fucking curtain in the mouth. And when you hear an established, successful Yo, artist... Look, look at this comment right here. Look at this comment. It's, it takes money to make money. That's what they said. I'm telling you this. There's rappers that don't have a single dollar that can make it. But there's going to be a time when you needed somebody to shoot your video. There's somebody that is going to take time... When you need somebody to edit your video, you need to, you need money to book studio time. You need money for the people who really don't have money. It's gonna be hard, but it's possible. It's possible. Just keep on doing what you're doing. Yo, take it from the biggest star in the fucking world right now with no editorial, no playlisting, no radio, no push. Who's hot? Who? Who got more followers than me right now in the new game? Name the hottest rappers right now. Just name them. It's not all this. No, they're not in your generation. They're not even... We're, a- we're talking about the, the Dre's. We're talking about the J. Cole's. They they put out their first record 10 years before you were a thing. Yeah, 10 years. That's a decade. I'm talking about the new rappers right now in my generation that came out in 2018. Or even okay. before that. All right, 2018 and before, we talking about Uzi. Of course, we talking and about... And I love Uzi. I we love... We talking him. about Cardi. We talking about... Who else? You talking about Playboy Cardi? Cardi? Yeah, Playboy Cardi, of course. Uh, um, just even going forward... Take uh, it from me. They don't have as much of a following or the interaction on my social media accounts. The influence is huge. Remember, I love Uzi. I love Cardi and them. Take it from somebody who's platinum. Take it some from somebody who beat the industry, who proved to you. I don't gotta, I don't gotta prove this to you. I don't. I wanna show you. There's a I wanna add somebody. Let's add somebody. Let's add somebody. Let's add somebody. Hey, for my audience, I just wanna let y'all know because you know, as as I had a couple of artists who are all Let's add somebody. Hold on, hold on. Hey, you pick them, you pick them. No, just as, add somebody, add somebody. As we have... as we add have, anybody, add anybody. As we have a bunch of artists, you know, who their industry program trying to even cancel, like, someone like me who's individually built, it's important for this moment because there's an artist right now with 200 followers that who think better. that 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 way, that that artist who is talking, who's controlled by their label, they can't talk out of turn. If you question anything, they can't speak up. They go mute when certain things, their label shuts them down when they want to. I'm only bringing this to y'all because I came out, and all these, a lot of these media outlets don't fuck with me. Yeah. I fucked up the media game. All these websites used to be popping, yo, Atkins here, what up? I'm here. My bad. I'm here. Atkins here. You get me? They don't fuck with me. It's, it's, it's neither here nor there. Whether, whatever you think about Six, he did the same to the rap game. I can't even lie to you. And by the way, his label, they're very dope. I don't know 
other than that billboard they got for you, I don't know one dollar they spend in, in radio promotion. Yeah. Or no, no, in marketing. You've been the person whose major career go on. It's the era of the artist, the individual taking ownership. Salute to Tory, who's now independent. Salute to Russ, now independent. These people are realizing what and the I game love, is. And I love how Tory, Tory got independent and wanted that for his kids. I don't know Russ. I never spoke to Russ. Great, dude. but I love how Russ tries to show the fans. Yo, listen. Yo, hold on. Hold on. Listen, listen, hold on. For all you fans, they spam, they spam Look, for all you, for all you, for all you, for all you, for all you fans that got three hundred followers, a thousand followers and down, nine thousand followers and down. Try to understand that these rappers are trying to show you the game. I'm, we're giving you free game. But I don't have to show you. I don't want you to be bigger than me. I don't have to show you. I'm trying to tell you, the industry is rigged. I, yo, Google's platinum. But that was mad quick, right? That was pretty quick. Is trolls gold? Absolutely. It's about to be platinum. It's about to be platinum. What the fuck? I gotta tell y'all niggas how the game. I'm trying to help you. I'm trying to help you. The game is rigged. I'm telling you the game is rigged. Understand that. Yo, add somebody. All right, add somebody. I, I want to add somebody. Whoever requests, how, do, how does this go? Is it this? No, that's questions. We're not doing questions. Go live with... Just anybody, anybody. Just hey, random, random. Hey, whoever comment right now, just be like, add me. Yeah. Okay, I'm, 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 I'm going to add you right now. This thing is saying about an intellectual conversation. Wow. <laughs> this is what happens. And I think you learned the lesson because... You feel so privileged, you feel like you got to pass it along. Mm-hmm. Niggas don't want that. <laughs> Niggas want to throw. What up? What's going on? Yo, listen. Yo, listen. What, what's, I can't turn on the light. I can't see yeah. it. You can turn on the light? Oh, hold on. It's dark here. What's your name? Keith. Yo, Keith, listen. Listen, we all know I'm a rat, so if you come say I'm a rat, the whole world is a rat. So listen. How do you feel? Are you a rapper? I can't hear you. Nah. You're not a rapper? Nah. How you feel about the, the music industry? I feel like it's exactly what everything y'all just said, honestly. Because, like, anybody can see, like, what y'all are doing is, like, it, it doesn't make sense the fact that so, somebody can have so many views. Right, and then you can say that you bought it, and it's it's actually like a legit thing. And I'm like, it, it baffles yo, yo, me because like yo, you can say it a million Drew? times, but nobody's gonna listen. You say your name is Drew? No, Keith. Keith, Keith, my bad, Keith. Yo, Keith, be honest with me, right? You know Fredo Santana? Yeah. Only what because I know Kendrick. Time? Huh? Only because I know that one song with Kendrick he had. What was the last time you thought about Fredo Santana? It's been a minute. You think, you think, how old are you? 24. You have a job? Uh, yeah. I. Right. When you wake up to work, do you think about Fredo Santana or anything musically that he done? Were you ready to go to work? I mean, unless I'm playing a song, no. So whenever you're doing something with life, whether it's taking care of your kids, going to work, paying a bill, paying your phone bill, does Fredo Santana cross your mind? Nah. People, what I want the world to know is that people just forget. People forget, and when you're dead, people got their own life to think of life moves on. Life moves on. People just don't understand that when you're dead, the real, the fake love comes. And listen, if I was still in jail, Keith, um, Keith, Keith, if I was still in jail right now, you wouldn't be allowed. Right now, you'd be scrolling on Instagram, and obviously you follow academics, right? Let me go on academics page. Right now, you'll be, you'll be wondering what Ti said to Fifty. You wouldn't think about six times because. Six nine not a fucking concern. I'll be in jail doing fucking seven years. Do you understand that? True. So people only have a fucking opinion when it's time to have an opinion on people. Listen, this world is fucked up. 
right? I'm trying to get people to game because they don't understand that this industry is break, straight breaks. You know what I'm saying? Nah, for real. Oh yeah. Um, but like I said, yo, yo, Kendrick, yo, Kendrick, right? Keys, 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 keys. Yo, Keith, my bad. Yo, Keith, my member. You see how I'm gonna forget a name? What makes you think I'm gonna forget? Like, you know what I'm trying to say, bro? Like, people got bro. their own shit to worry about. You right, bro. You right. <laughs> I'm like, like, yo, Keith, yo. But like, bro, it's like I feel like you can't you can't even explain it because it's like you're trying to you're trying to do what every basically every conscious rapper is trying to do, which is prove that the game is rigged and that there's people that, that's at the top doing other things. You know, Kanye did the same thing you're doing, bro. It's like I don't know how many times. Do that, yeah, when you do it's like, crazy, bro, bro, he's fucked out. It's like the way that you present it, though. It's like. It's too much for people, bro. Like, every single time I look at Ag, I see Ag Space, he's like, nah, you can't do that. Nah, you can't do that. It's like, but they already I'm know only, only, you have to I'm present it in a way where it's just I'm, like... Yo, I'm looking at him because I'm like, at the end of the day, you see, I'm a blogger. And I live in nah, culture. I go up and down with, with the news or whatever. It's hot or whatever. He's an artist. We got to live and die with his music and his musical career. So when he started exposing the game, I look at him to be like, nigga, everybody who's benefiting from the game being rigged is looking at you like you're fucking it up to them. Right? Yo, you're Keith, fucking it up. Yo, Keith, I'm, I'm about to ask somebody else. Just, just before I take yeah. you down, just call, just call me a rat real quick. Just say you a rat. Nah, chill, chill, just chill. Say it real quick. It makes I'm me feel better. It makes me feel better. Please. All right, all right. You a rat then. Thank you, Keith. Thank you. <laughs> but real shit, nigga. Niggas don't want to believe it. All these rappers that are dead, niggas forget about. I for, I'm going to the store to buy a milk. I can probably even afford it. I got $3.50 in my pocket. I got to buy this milk. You think I give a fuck about the rapper that died in 2017? I don't give a fuck. I got bills to pay, nigga. You think I care about a nigga that's been in jail for 10, 20 years that might never come home? I don't give a fuck. I got, I got bills to pay, nigga. You know what's gonna happen? Um, um, Juice World just announced his album is coming out Friday. We love Juice World. Love, love Juice World. Juice World. Yo, and look, look all of these rappers wait, I got messages with. Like, wait, 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 look wait. what Juice World said. This, this is one reason I respect Juice World, right? Look what Juice World said. And by the way, you were clowning Juice World last time. I was clowning Juice World. Look what he hit me with. This is when I was clowning him. He messaged me. Look, Juice World messaged me and said, "You show it down." It might be on this he I said, mean, he said, boy, that video funny as hell. I can't stop watching it. By the way, that's the video where you're I was clowning him. him. I can't see his shadows in my room. room. Yeah. I, when I was counting Juice World, he wrote me and said, he wrote me and said, Juice World wrote me and said, yo, that video is so funny. I can't stop watching it. That's the type of nigga Juice World was. Funny ass nigga. Yo, you were funny. And you know what I said? I said, yo, call me. He said, look, 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 look what Juice World wrote to me, right? He said, you taking over the world. I said, peace, King. He said, what's your number? I sent it. Why don't y'all show the love to Juice World when he was alive? Why take for him to be deaf? You gotta show the love. Huh? Why? You know why? Because people gotta start realizing that y'all got a lot of fucking fake and hate me y'all fucking blood and 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 this 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 mad fancy that is is loving and caring but you know there's some, right. a lot of fucking haters let me, let me bring this up yeah i would say if you're not the your top three most clouded rapper right now mm-hmm. but i would say half of the people who follow you they don't wish you well they can't wait for you to get beat up they can't wait for you to get shot they can't wait for somebody to catch you lacking. They can't wait for your address to be exposed. They can't wait for you to be meat milling the chase and run. That's what they're waiting for. And I guess, like, in, in regards to what you're saying, is that a lot of times with artists, the people who, and I think 65% of your audience can't, it's, it's like Floyd. Floyd admitted it. Most of his audience can't wait for him to take an L. But here's the thing. If those if those people in the audience that couldn't wait for him to take an L 
channeled their energy into someone who they couldn't wait to win, it would be a different story. But yo, I love I love how you put that. If you channel all of that energy you have for somebody to die or lose, and you use that somebody for somebody that you wanted to see and win and be successful, we wouldn't have a Nipsey. We wouldn't have a Pop Smoke. We wouldn't have a Juice World. And by, by the, and we, we wouldn't have a Mac Miller. And, and what, we, what we mean by that is we're seeing so much love, love after, after they dead. dead. After Why are you dead. showing them so much love after they died? Why didn't you channel that energy you showing now before they died? Hey, again, let me tell you this. So this week, I don't know if you know, because I've got to leave you online. This week, Meek Mill, Freddie Gibbs, like uh, like eight other irrelevant rappers, they said they were canceling me, right? Do you want to know that this is the most attention I've ever gotten in my career? Name, you know what? Hold on. Name one Freddie Gibbs song. I can't. Okay. I can't either. Okay, here's the thing. But they all said, we're, we don't like this guy. We're all going to focus on him. But and you know why, though, right? No, 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 no. We can get to the why. I was only saying to you, they've never channeled and they've never grouped up out of love. It's sad that people have never united through love. In hip hop these days, the best way to unite niggas is to find a common enemy. They never find a common person they fuck with. Think about that. You think Meek and Freddie Gibbs is talking if they like an artist? Be honest. No. Now I'm asking you. Why doesn't Meek give Freddie like, Gibbs a song? If they like an artist together, does Meek and Freddie Gibbs actually come together? Yes or no? No. But they both hate academics. Yo, hold oh, on, no, no. Fuck that. Fuck that. That, that. That's 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 whack. Everybody knows that. No, they don't. They don't. Oh, no, no, no. Everybody, look. This is the facts of the facts, they, they right? Meek Mill's hypocrite. I don't even know what's another word other than hypocrite. Meek Mill is signed to a correction officer. You know the people you hate in jail. When when you're an a inmate in jail, the person you hate the most is a CO. Why? Yo, CO, let me get some tissue. Yo, CO, turn on my light. Yo, CO, can you heat this up in the microwave for me? Yo, CO, the person you hate the most is a CO. You're signed to a fucking correctional officer. How does that work? How? Hold on, my man. I love Ross. Ross is amazing. I like Ross. Ross is That's your opinion. I love Ross. He's a, I have, he's a boss. He got full mad wing stuff. I'm bad. I love wing stuff. I haven't told you the story. Nah, fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck that. Oh. You're talking about me. <laughs> Meek is signed to Rick Ross, a correctional officer and then has a distribution deal with rock nation the ceo of rock nation is a, is a cooperating with that rock. took down two cartels so you're you're signed to a cop right a ceo you're signed to a cop and you're managed by a rat what hold on hold on you're signed MMG is with, is, is with Rick Ross, right? You're signed to a rat. I mean, no, you're signed to a, a cop. A correctional officer. A cop. It's, it's, it's correctional yeah, officers. A lot of, I have a, yeah, correctional officers are cops that couldn't be cops. So they have to be COs. You didn't pass the test. You were dumb. Listen. You're signed to a cop and managed by a rat. Cop 